The state's first wave of COVID-19 slows down. Restrictions on commercial and recreational boating are being lifted. But there are being limits placed on the number of passengers, and that could keep many commercial boaters docked in the harbor. Sam Spangler with more in tonight's top story. Boats can now include up to 10 people at a time, with crew included. Now, the only exception is if everyone is from the same household. Many commercial charter boat operations will be forced to remain closed until capacity allows for more profit. That's according to Ocean Tourism Coalition President Jim Kuhn. As far as the commercial side is concerned, it doesn't really help most of the commercial operators. With a 10 person limit, it's a good start and it'll help just some of the smallest boats. While restaurants and some airlines are getting back in business with reduced capacity, Kuhn says he wasn't informed why vessels are held to a different standard. We're very much like a restaurant that needs a certain number of, just a certain volume in order for, for us to, to be able to produce a product. He says larger boats are able to safely socially distance a larger number of passengers. Think of this. Uh, let's take a, take a 65 by 30 foot uh, vessel and some of them will have more than one deck, but even just as, as one deck, you've got almost 2,000 square feet there, uh, similar to what a restaurant might be. While Kuhn admits that the return of tourism is desperately needed. In truth, our industry is not going to really be able to do much of anything until, until Hawaii is opened up for tourism. A portion of the estimated 3,000 jobs in commercial charter boats across the state could be saved by opening up to local customers. We really would like to open up and uh, uh, even if it, and just to start off with the local community, it would be great. Now, Kuhn also says that losing employees to other states is particularly difficult because of the first aid and ocean safety training requirements. Now, other ocean water sports like surf schools and kayaks are available to be open but are limited to 10 people, including staff members. For more on that, you can swing by our website, khon2.com. Sam Spangler, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.